If dark red blood was vomited, the casualty may have an injury to their A, stomach, B, lungs, C, head, or D, lower bowel. So what answer do you think it is? Dark red blood was vomited, the casualty may have an injury to their what? Lungs, lower bowel, head, or stomach. A crush injury should not be released after A, 5 minutes, B, 10 minutes, C, 15 minutes, or D, 20 minutes. Now we haven't covered a crush injury, so I have a guess on this. If somebody's got a crush injury to any part of their body, if they've been there for how many minutes after which shouldn't you remove them? And the answer is... Minutes. If bleeding seeps through the initial dressing applied to an injured limb, you should A. Remove it and replace it with a bigger dressing. B. Leave it and wait for it to stop. C. Apply a tourniquet to the injured limb. Or D. Apply a second dressing directly on top. Cast your mind back to the video in the factory. What did the first aider do to the lady who had a cut on her arm? A, B, C, or D. Do you remember? It was... D. Second dressing on top. If your casualty is conscious and has suffered a deep incision to the forehead, they should ideally be placed in what position? A. In the recovery position. B. Laid down with legs raised. C. Laid down with legs and head raised. Or D. Laid on their side, injured side down. So, A, B, C, or D? The answer is... Lay down the legs and the In what position would you place a conscious casualty suffering from a penetrating wound to the chest? A. Laying down with legs elevated. B. Half sitting, inclined towards injured side with head and shoulders raised. C. Half sitting, inclined away from injured side with head and shoulders raised. Or D. Sitting up with support under knees. Again, this is something we haven't covered. Um, it's part of the more advanced first aid training. The answer is... This is a word search. Uh, what I would suggest you do is uh, pause the video, um, do uh, a print screen, you can then print it out, and then find all the uh, words, abrasion, capillary contusion, dressing in size, infection, laceration and wounds in the word search grid. Uh, I can give you the answers. Shall I give you the answers? The answers are there. Okay, let's go back to restart. So, um, if you're quick enough to take a word search, or actually, um, you could uh, pause it where I clicked on the answers, and you could print that out, just to keep a check on data. Uh, I done a bit quick, so I'll do that again. So, again, if you wanna pause the video, uh, do a print screen, and you got all the answers there. Your casualty has fallen on broken glass and has some glass embedded in the wound. He is conscious and in severe pain. You have a fully stocked first aid kit available to you and there is no help available. What is your treatment? A. Open the airway and check for breathing. B. Leave your casualty and call for an ambulance. C. Shout for help, control the bleeding and treat for shock. Or D. Remove the glass and dress the wound before calling for an ambulance. So which one do you want to go for? A, B, C, or D? Oh, no, it's 
go wrong? Shout for help, control the bleeding, and treat for shock. So that's C I'm looking for. 